You've probably heard of the tiny blind salamander, an endangered species only found in springs near San Antonio. Well, there's been a large effort to save it, along with others, on the brink of extinction. And as our Justin Horn shows us, that effort is drawing praise, this time all the way from Washington. Extremely impressed, extremely. Words from a Washington, D.C. VIP visiting the San Antonio area this week. She's talking about the EAA's Habitat Conservation Plan, a mandate to keep springs flowing handed down by the federal government courtesy of the Endangered Species Act. It got underway in 2012. We had a court order that said we had to come up with a plan for the aquifer to manage it. And protect its endangered species, like the now famous fountain darter. Have you ever seen a fountain darter before? I haven't. Uh, only a picture. <laughs> the excitement was there as Schultz and others from the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service got a glance at the swift-moving, tiny you get two inch when you've got a trophy size. fish found only in the Comal and San Marcos rivers. Right now, you're looking at Texas wild rice. It's one of eight species protected by the Habitat Conservation Plan. And since the plan's been put into place, many of these species have been thriving and their population is growing. A success story, as those here are calling it, thanks to a joint effort. They were cities, uh, water utility companies, uh, environmental agencies. Coming together using creative ideas to meet federal standards while preserving a Texas appreciation of land ownership. It can become a win-win for everybody. Conservation for the species is good for people too. Justin Horn, KSAT 12 News.